to another one of my crazy crossroads big joey c big rob they drove up from florida to come hang out um happy new year uh if you saw my video this morning i said we had a little surprise for you it's these beautiful faces look at them so gorgeous we are at the machete house the machete murder house so a guy that i met a couple of months ago told me about this place and it's on it on the way to the plantation house that we filmed in the past we just weren't too sure about if we were able to access the property it's 65 acres guys we're in the middle of the woods it's it's just about completely dark it's freaky as hell the house apparently was uh, some somebody apparently murdered somebody with a machete chopped them up into pieces blah 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 I researched it couldn't find anything but there's a cop that uh, oversees the property and uh, he told us it's okay to come up here just you know respect the property but he said it's haunted as hell and uh, if we're stuck in there he's not coming to get us because he'll never step foot in that house so we're gonna go in there have some fun see what's happening in here and then hopefully we can get to the plantation house tonight before curfew so we'll see you guys in a bit deuces all right okay here we go so it's definitely creepy um, we're in the middle of the woods here. If I didn't have light, obviously it would be even more <laughs> extremely scary. Um, kind of got a little head start on Joe and Rob, but um, it's a beautiful piece of property. And I mean, just look at the, the sun setting. Now, guys, there is a curfew in, uh, in, the Carolina, in North Carolina. So we have to do all our filming and get it all in before that curfew look how beautiful so that's highway 77 that comes across so anyone that's uh, from this area I'm sure you've seen this house before um, fill us in let us know uh, if some of the stories are true or or whatever um, it's definitely creepy is it haunted we'll find out I just would really love to know if there was actually that so-called said murder in here but anyway we're almost to the house guys now down below um, is a drop-off right over here and as you get closer to the house that drop-off keeps getting steeper and steeper is a little creepy. What is that? Oh, like chicken coop. Oh, yeah. Whoa, you okay? Yeah, I, mean, I think it was just a stick block. I like, heard like something coming out of there. Oh, I thought he heard something coming out of there. Yeah, 
So this could all be part, because if you look over there to the right, there's all this decking that wrapped probably around this house. And then there was probably decking and stuff leading down to the, the lake. It's a swing. possibly a swing set. Yeah. This could have been here, or maybe it was in this no, all Yeah, you know what, that probably was a swing set. Look at this place. Yeah, there was some wraparound wood deck. Wow, look at this. Look how beautiful that skyline, skyline is. <clears throat> what? It looks like this used to go out farther. Yeah, yeah, this probably hung over. You know, the deck probably hung over the... It's kind of like my backyard. I'm going to put... I had that big drop off. But I was thinking about putting it put in the deck. Careful. Wow, this is nuts. Holy crap, yeah. Definitely creepy. fireplace hey Joe is that you yes, me. were you just saying were you just talking yeah okay. I was saying how like a lot of these places I find dark and yeah, this I is think something like attaches to us to be honest with you you know this is eerie like, dude the trailer really felt spooked. this is and, eerie uh, Look at this staircase, man. Talk about creepy. Look at that. Holy crap, look at that. It's like uh, the Brady Bunch. It's like the little scary Be out. careful. Is it sturdy? Um, yeah, it seems alright. Hey, man, look, there's another nail. There's nails sticking out everywhere, so just be yeah, real careful. Yeah, I saw that coming in. I'm going to go through this back room here and then I'll come up. Wow, this place is just disheveled. It's hard to even make sense of what room is what or what this was. <clears throat> yeah, yep, right over here. Dude, these nails sticking up everywhere are freaking me out. Yeah. Just watch your head. Who was that? Huh? Who was yeah. that? Joe? It sounded like someone went. Hey, buddy. Joe? This is really freaking me out. All these nails. Oh, wow. Did you look out here? Whoa, this is crazy. Is this the front?
So this looks like maybe this was the front door that may have been the roof that has completely collapsed. This place is trash. Where's Joe? No. Who are you talking to? Oh, the camera? Joe? Hey, did you? Oh, what happened? Have you heard? It, it's hard to hear anything. But I thought downstairs it sounded like he said he thought he heard like a broof. But I thought I heard like a hail. But I, you were all the way, I came up here, you were all the way back there. Just now, I thought I heard something this way, but it quite possibly could have been you. Cause I, know, I mean, I was doing a little talking about like, you know, like I, know. I think something follows us on these locations. Yeah. But. Yeah. Oh, look at this porch. Is this like a back outdoor porch? It sure is. See how the FRP up top? Wow. Crazy. This place is just collapsing, huh? I know. I'll tell you what, though. The uh, Joe, the it, it feels sturdy, sturdier than anywhere else we've ever been. Ah. Yeah, that's the roof from the front porch. <clears throat> the downstairs freaks me out more than the upstairs. There's nails sticking up everywhere. There's a machete oh, in the, the wall. Fuck. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh. oh. There's a machete in the wall. <laughs> it really is the machete house. This is unreal. Alright, so the, um Do we no we don't want to mess with that? There's there. also a spring up in oh, the what wall. What the hell is that? It's a spring loaded machete. <laughs> um so okay. What is that? So we heard this house was called Machete House and there's a machete in this house. Look, it's wet. <clears throat> is it really? We got too much we got too much light on it. Oh, that's weird, man. Let me lower this light a little. Really, let me see. It, that thing is right through the wall. Maybe that's why it's called Machete House. I don't know. I just how freaky that there's I mean, it's pretty ironic, right? It's actually a machete in this house. Yeah. Hey, Rob. Yo, Rob. Hey, Rob. Oh, that is crazy. The, the spring cracks me up. Wow, oh, we got it. It's freaky. Oh, now, so what did your friend say, or the well, my sorry friend, but what did this person tell you? He told me that there was a murder with a machete, and that, and that is a the machete. person was chopped up into I pieces, mean, and here we are. Do you think that we're being set up by this person? I mean, there's a machete here, bro. Or do you think that maybe... Do you think that's like a staple for the house? Like, it could, I mean, it could, it's a, I mean, I, I'm it's almost easy. laughing. It's... Yeah. it's Okay. Uh, by the uh, way, we, we still want to do the uh, we still want to do the uh, necrophonic app. Maybe see what it says. But Joe's fifty-two. I'm fifty. Right. And we chuckled because this house is labeled <laughs> the Machete House, and here we are, like fifteen-year-old kids trying to get in before the North Carolina curfew, so we don't get in trouble. And we're filming the Machete. Oh my God! I heard the words. <laughs> is that Rob? <laughs> Rob almost fell through the roof. So here we are, 50 years old, going through the machete house. It's just comic guys. This, this is our job. This is our life. 
We were cracking up. Why wouldn't they name it the? What was that? I'm just expecting Rob to come through the ceiling at any given moment. <laughs> I hope I, I don't want him to get hurt, but if he does, my goodness, how funny would that be? <laughs> so we laughed the whole time. The reason why sometimes you gotta spring laugh. loaded yes. machete. Yeah, I don't. And uh, I agree with you, but Jeff. But I'm still curious to see now. In my theory, though, whereas something follows us, I believe, even though the necrophonic app is just an app on the phone, but I wonder if it says anything about the machete or this place. It'd be kind of interesting to see. I don't really hear anything here. Do you or see anything? No, I mean, I. You, you always can. You think you hear stuff, but right. until you play it back. All right. So you know, which is try the app, but I'm just trying another thing. You know, if, if you guys hear anything, I know we're having a good time and laughing and being real loud, but um, it's kind of strange. Down here, you get a little bit of a weird vibe, but um, the machete's funny. It's a cool explore, if anything. I mean, look at some of this graffiti. I love capturing the graffiti on camera. It looks so cool. I mean, it really looks good. Every time I film somewhere that has a lot of graffiti, I was going to say a lot of machetes. <laughs> It just films so nice. Wow, I mean, just look at this house. It overlooks this lake. Unfortunately, this house might... Well, no, it couldn't have been built before the highway was there. It's fall, so in the spring when everything's full here, you're not really going to see the road, but you can certainly hear it. particular uh, machete here and again are we being pranked maybe I mean it's possible that somebody's pranking us but at the same time let's see uh, let's see what the necrophonic app has to say we're well, gonna go are we going necro yeah I, I think it'd we're be going a good necro. idea we're I think it'd be a good idea so let's necro it yeah so we're gonna try this out and uh, we're gonna necro oops sorry hold on guys so maybe we picked up stuff we didn't know here it's possible I'm not, and I, I want to clarify, I'm not definitely saying somebody put that there and, we're, you know, that, that the person who sent us here definitely did that, but it is kind of comical that there is a machete sticking out of the wall over well, my, my, my shoulder. My thought is, is that's been there for who knows how long and everybody just everybody calls it, calls the, machete it the machete house. And but to test the theory, let's see if in fact the Necrophonic app will actually give us any information as to why this machete's in the wall. Machete. There's a machete in the oh, wall. Oh, look at that. Rob's got the light right in my eyes. There's a machete in the wall. Yeah, come here, Rob. You haven't seen it yet. Rob, <laughs> Rob goes machete. Oh, one second. Machete yeah. in a spring. Yeah. Spring. Yeah. yeah. It's a spring-loaded machete. Yeah, so, yeah, there's a machete right here, and there's a spring. How weird is that, right? What was that? Touching what me. was that? Something just went. Uh. <laughs> the freak was that? Something. <laughs> something just went. Uh. <laughs> Sorry guys, we were like, okay. Holy Sometimes shit. when we do these explorers, we're like little kids, so we're laughing. And you know what? One of the best things about doing these videos is doing videos with friends, having a good time. Do we pick up stuff? Absolutely. I think we just picked up something. I just do that. Either that or one of us was, was going, and I don't think so. so. Anyway, All right, can uh, you? Yeah, yeah okay. App. Sorry, guys, I'm trying to adjust the camera here. Or you want to show that you follow us, or you want to let us know about this machete, I'm curious to see if it'll, it'll tell us anything that's relevant to this. That was funny. Wow. <laughs> Tell us about the machete. <laughs> was that machete placed here by somebody to trick us? Did that say no? I 
don't know, guys. It's, I still don't know the answer to this one. It says something about a dead man. Whoa! Don't touch it? Is that what it said? Trigger object. What is this on my hand? I think it said machete. I don't know, I could be wrong, guys. You know, it honestly kind of almost looks like it's relatively new. Yeah, it doesn't. Definitely doesn't look like it's been sitting here for long. Did you hear that? You heard something? You heard talking? Yep. Definitely did. I'll tell you what, I got a machete in my hand. Somebody runs up on me and Maybe the spirit's gonna take me over and make me the. <laughs> yeah, I know. Should I put it back in the wall? I think what we should do is probably take the machete. Mm -hmm. Hey, you know what? You yeah. guys use a machete. You know, I saw your lawn, man. It's a little long. Uh, <laughs> My lawn. Take man. care of it, brother. Explodes and we'll laugh over the ass off. Got pain all over you. Mm. So, I'm just going to say, hey, B, I'm not going to say your name. I might have said it already. Did I say, did I say his name who sent this here? Okay, so if you sent this out here because you knew there was a machete stuck in the wall and made up that story, that's pretty funny. I got to say, that's pretty funny. We're having a blast, though, so you're not going to rain on our parade. I swear we thought... We thought we just heard somebody talking, and uh, the cop said he'd never step foot in this house. So, hey, you know, the cop did say he'll never step foot in this house. Yeah, that is true. So, I mean, if the cop's there, we can give it to him. We can give it to him. You know what? That might be a good idea because... <clears throat> just in case, because he did say there's kids and stuff that come out here that do drugs and all that. So we okay. needed some tweaker, right? Yeah, and you know what else too? The, another reason why I want to take this is I don't want to leave it here if some kid comes in this on this property or something. I don't want anybody to get hurt. So we're gonna turn this into the police. Joe just uh, repeated exactly what I've said. So we're gonna give this to exactly uh, what I said. That's so funny. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, this is actually kind of a, this is a fun, uh, this is actually a fun little explorer though, you know? Yeah. 
dude. Your big ass scares the hell out of me. And that thing. And wait. Downstairs, we just heard something. Wait. Yeah, we definitely heard some. I heard somebody talking. I mean, upstairs, I got really kind of uncomfortable, but that's it. Yeah. Like, what? Oh, <laughs> Rob just having issues with sticks. <laughs> So guys, we were here maybe, what, 25 minutes. Um, cool, cool place to come check out. Uh, I don't buy it. I don't buy the little story, but whatever. It is it is what it is. But it was a fun place to come to, and I'm glad we did. Because I'm with my friends. What is he doing? Joe's waving the Michelle. Oh. All right, so cool place. Don't think it's haunted. There's so much damn road noise and stuff, so it's hard to tell. If you hear anything, please let, let me know down in the comments below. And uh, as always, guys, see everything down in the description. Happy New Year to everybody. We're going to be heading over, hopefully we can get over to the uh, plantation house in time uh, to do some more videos. We've got a few more coming your way for the rest of the week. Um, we're going to film for a couple days, but I hope this video finds you all happy, safe, and healthy. Um, my new mailing address is down in, in the description as well. I don't know why all of a sudden I started, started it. But I love you all. We'll see you next time. Deuces.